First offering on its way. And we are underway from Fenway as the first pitch of the night is taken for ball one. Count even now at one and one. Very mild temperatures as we begin tonight. 58 degrees here at first pitch. Missed with a slider. It's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Schwarber ranging back at the track. And just short of a home run, this ball's off the wall. And he is in to third with a leadoff triple. First pitch coming, here it is. A little bouncer. But it's foul, strike one. The 0 1 pitch. Hit hard to the right side. There's one. Back to first, so they get the double play, but the run in now. Ryan Sandberg. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Second baseman, Ryan. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now started to go down after it, and he couldn't hold back. It's strike one. Trip, trip, trip. He was able to foul that one off, but you could tell he was definitely late. That breaking ball, the pitch before that heater right there, definitely threw his timing off. Here we go. Popped him up. Aguilar has a play. One day. Jose Alvarez, a 5'11 inch left handed reliever, enters to take over on the mound now. Here comes the pitch to Moss. Checks his swing, but this pitch is right there for strike one. One thing I'm going to keep my eye on with this young starter on the mound is how he's able to stay ahead of hitters. It makes pitching at this level a lot easier. And when you're trying to establish yourself in the big leagues, you're going to have a much better time doing that if you attack hitters from the get-go. Uh, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. That one go? You know that's the kind of pitch he likes to take a big hack at. Not too many power hitters that don't like a stomach-high fastball, so he's probably not throwing that one again. Uh, he lets him off the hook there as this is move. Boy, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, you have to make sure it's up above the zone like that. Deal, deal, he deal. can't do a whole lot with that, but if it were a little lower, he can and will make you pay big time. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss as he chases one out of the zone for the third strike. Coming to the plate now, Colby Rasmus. He'll get us started in the top of the second. Right fielder, Colby Rasmus. Hit in the air down the right field line. Upton's under it. And that's the first out of the inning. A changeup taken for a strike. <laughs> that changeup came in at 89 miles an hour. You know a guy throws hard when his off speed is in the high 80s. On the move is Rasmus. He's got it. One away. nobody on. Rip down the first base line. And he'll step on right. Makes a lot of great contact against left-handed pitching. Perhaps one of the best in the game in that regard. But he does have his warts against right-handers at times. Just not as proficient at putting the ball in play when it's come. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end. Here's Manny Machado now. He'll lead it off here. Kelvin Herrera. 5'10 right-hander comes in out of the bullpen to do the pitching. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0-1. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0-2. Ready on 0-2. Swing and a miss as he... Swing by Crone, and it's hammered out to left field. 
Schwarber should have room. And he brings it in on the water here. Howler. No swing, apparently. Ball one. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. The 2 0. Down low, and the plot thickens here. 3 and 0. And he'll just make him throw one over here. 3 and 1. Great spot with that pitch down and away. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep hitting that spot. And good pace. Oh. Strike one. He'll be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home go, that go. time run from first. Pitch inside the throw. Whoa. Perfect throw, and they got him at second. And Ryan Sandberg. Second he popped out in his first trip. Ryan Sandberg. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Sends that one out of play for strike one. This guy's one of the best bunters in the league, but with two outs, I'm not sure that's a really good play right now. He might be forced to go ahead and swing the bat and try to get an extra base hit here with two outs. That's his first base hit. Making this is a steal situation right here. Two outs and the leadoff hitter on first. This is the time you roll the dice and hope he gets in the scoring position. Throw in time, and the ball game is over. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our top player of the game. Well, you know he wants that one pitch back that led to the lone hit, but it was pretty awesome watching him do his thing. He had guys off balance and flailing at the plate all game long, so he really was the story. For the home team, no run, just one hit, no errors. They left two men on base. Time of the ball game, a swift two hours and 19.